behind the line. Three, two, one, go. Second to last qualification match gets underway. Pretty quickly, Jack in the Bot starts filling up that top hub. Actually, both alliances now working to fill up the top hub. Those are worth four points a piece per piece of cargo scored in the top part of the hub. I'm not going to bother keeping a live track of this. Dear computer, what do you say? They say five pieces of cargo scored actually for each alliance, and that'll bring both of their thresholds down to 18 pieces of cargo required for the bonus rank point later in the match. Anyone's game, 32 to 30 with red leading as drivers now start taking control. We have our number one and two ranked teams playing against each other here in this one. Jack and the Bot in red, Stealth Robotics in blue. Sushi Squad also, I believe they're in like third or fourth right now. They're on the Red Alliance side here. Pretty notorious, reliable scoring outburst. Here from all of these Red Alliance teams, Robo Totes flip themselves over. Down in the bottom left corner of the field, that looks like that might be it for them for the match, unless a teammate can come flip them back over. So the Blue Alliance will take a bit of a power play opportunity here. Iron Patriots filling up the low hub for the Blue Alliance, while Stealth Robotics, youch, well, at least formerly was filling up the high hub. We'll see if that impact changes anything about their future strategy. Looks like it's still, yeah, somewhat dialed in. Both of those shots bounce out, but out of the inside of the hub, at least. Sushi Squad and Jack and the Bot now working on the Red Alliance offensive cycle. Sushi Squad, layup. One of them successful, the other one bounces out. That'll be two points. Jack and the Bot brings over four more points with two pieces of red cargo in the high goal as well. Your live score is starting to break away here. The Red Alliance focusing solely on that high goal. It's starting to pay off. 70 to 61 with a little over a half a minute left to play. Jack and the Bot now lines up in the hangar. They want to grab on to the middle rung. Click and set. They're ready to go while the Sushi Squad continues the Red Alliance cargo outburst with one more two-point piece of cargo. Jack and the Bot's now on the high rung for red, and they're going to go for the traversal. Formerly in the hangar, Stealth Robotics looked like they were poised to try and be the Blue Alliance counterpart. They instead go change strategy to work on cargo. They've got just seven seconds as an alliance in total to try and get any climb points going. Looks like time will expire. Both alliances picking up the bonus rank point for number of cargo. Neither alliance. 91 to 67. Your final score, and that will let Jack and the Bot stay on top of the leaderboard. Trading hands there. The Sushi Squad and Stealth Robotics flip positions, and the Sushi Squad moves up to second with those.